Hey guys, in this video I'll show you how to change AT&T router to 2.4 GHz. It's very easy and simple. First you need to actually connect to your AT&T network, okay? Make sure that your phone or computer is connected to your AT&T Wi-Fi. Then you open up a web browser and go to this address. This is the default gateway for most AT&T routers. So 192.168.1.254. And then you log in to your router settings, okay? And you may need to enter the access code. This is usually found on a sticker on the back or side of your router. And then what you do, so what you need to do is you need to go ahead to the Wi-Fi settings, right? And the router dashboard, you just find and click Home Network. And then just click on Wi-Fi from the menu. And you'll see options for the 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz network separately. What you need to do is just enable Okay, the 2.4 gigahertz band. So just select that, enable that. Okay. And just rename the 2.4 gigahertz SSID if needed. So you can easily identify it. Because you'll be getting two bands showing up under your network settings. So just go ahead and click on save and reconnect uh, both of your devices. Okay, any smart home devices or any gadgets connected to the 2.4 gigahertz network. Right. And if you're wondering why the 2.4 GHz network is used, it's because it has a longer range and it's more compatible with smart devices, but it's actually slower than the 5 GHz. We use it for the longer range, basically. But otherwise, it's really that easy and simple. So I hope this kind provided value to you. And if it did, consider smashing that like button. As always, well subscribing to frequently asked questions. And I'll see you in the next one.